Hi guys, I am Nao Satan and we are playing Lettuce today. We are on the mission number 10. So, um, I already tried to record this episode, but the whole game was lagging very severely and it was just not bearable. And at the end, the game just crashed uh, with my OBS, with everything, and uh, uh, recording of the first episode for, uh, well, for yeah, the, the recording this episode was basically corrupted so i couldn't actually do anything so i might feel like doing something again well but uh, i don't mind i really enjoy this game so we can start again with uh well i can start uh, again with this mission it's not really a problem and now it's actually run running pretty much smoothly so i don't have any kind of objections of uh, starting the game with our typical setup of three streets that will be our backbone of uh, workforce uh, for the uh, first uh, uh, for the first phase of the game so yes uh, this uh, this mission can be uh, quite interesting because because uh, we have to uh, export 5000 barley to other cities in a year so so this, excuse me. So this mission is strictly, well, nearly strictly, uh, a uh, a uh, trade mission. So it should be very interesting. It should be very interesting to play this mission because we didn't have this kind of thing before at all. So yeah, and uh, I think this one is a little bit off. That would bother me. Okay. Now it's okay, and of course I managed to misplace the roadblock, but that's not really a problem because we are already have nearly our setup done. Okay, here, here, those are the road roadblocks. Here we go, and now we have our first uh, three streets. Uh, immigrants are pouring in, so that's very nice. Now the next step will be the um, the food we'll place here. Uh, actually, yeah, well, why not? Seems okay. And for the food, we will go with pumpkin farms to three, four, and uh, here one, two, three, four. Okay. Here we go, and here uh, we'll need a second, uh, a granary house, and a maintenance guy, of course, and a granary. And this granary will uh, accept only pumpkins, nothing else. I know that we have a little bit of um, uh, uh, a little bit uh, of uh, workforce uh, deficit, but we will fix that, so that's not really a problem. Okay, so we have everything going on. Now we have to just uh, speed up the game a little bit because we just need more workforce, and well, they are pouring in, they are pouring in. So, yes. Do we have, we have four more, okay, that's pretty much okay, pretty much okay. It's not perfect, but that's okay. And now we just have to wait for the first harvest and uh, uh, we can advance our uh, housing uh, for more adequate. Uh, ideally, we would be just aiming for the level 10 uh, from the very beginning, but we have to do some progress before that. But everything is uh, before us, so I have good hopes. Okay, do we have, uh, we have unemployment, we have 64% unemployment because now we can really nicely place some shops. And the shopkeeper and the shopkeepers will go for the food, for the pumpkins that we just produced. We have 4,000 pumpkins only? Really? Only 4,000? I don't care. I thought that one farm is producing like 2400 and 
why well, it's not the case. Uh, those farms are pretty much inefficient. That's not ideal, that's not ideal at all. Hmm. Oh, well, um, either way, we'll just well, progress. Progress is the name of the game. So, uh, yes, and we'll make the uh, neighborhood more beautiful so our citizens will not come, uh, will not, uh, well, uh, whine about that. And also, they need the wash house, yes, they will need the wash house right now, so I will give them the wash house. Uh, only here right now because I don't want to waste my workforce ro from the very beginning. Okay, we have level four. With level four, we can have ghosts, so it's very wise to have the exorcist uh, ready here. And the next step would be the alcohol, but the alcohol production isn't. And we need 24 more workers, but they are pouring in, so we should be good in a second. In a second or more. I'm quite disappointed that the pumpkin ha pumpkin farms didn't produce more food. I thought that they would, but well, it seems that's not the case. Uh, but okay, but we are producing some, uh, some well, we'll be producing some uh, pumpkins, uh, some, uh, yeah, some pumpkins. The other way that we could get food is by ranch. That's also quite, uh, um, uh, oh, we, we have no... No, we have no bakeries and windmills. So, okay, so the other way would be the ranch, and that's also kinda, um, I think it might be a better way to do that, because ranch will produce uh, food constantly, uh, given that we have a steady supply of wheat. And that's a very good thing, because we can just produce wheat, and then half of our uh, production will be just actually producing for the whole year so they will not uh, create a, um, artificial unemployment but uh, well yeah pumpkins are just easier at the very beginning so I went with pumpkins maybe it's actually better way maybe it's actually a better idea to actually just go and uh, and uh, do it with wheat maybe it's a better idea I don't know hmm. a very good question i don't know i don't know well anyways uh, we have the second shipment of uh, pumpkins i i hope that it will be for the uh, on one of those streets yes it is so we should have advancement here in a very very short while so i can make the uh, exit list of course and the wash house of course and this wash house is a very annoying one yeah, it is a very annoying one. Hmm. Okay. Now it will be proper. Yeah, this is the one of the the, the, the things that's just annoying uh, with this game, is that uh, how you place your uh, buildings towards the road. It would be nice if it would be just possible to actually rotate the building. And just well place the action tile somewhere else, and that would be so so nice, really. But yeah, well, it's not not possible. So yeah, well, we ca we have to deal with it. Okay, so this is like this, and I think I will actually go and switch to those wheat farms. Either ways, because I'm thinking about it, and I think that's a better idea. Yeah, and we'll accept wheat. We'll, no, uh, we'll try to empty pumpkins somehow. I don't know how. And here we'll just make more ranches. Well, we'll just make ranches. One, two, three, three for uh, the very, very, uh, very uh, for the very beginning. And I think I uh, messed up the placement. Yes, I did mess up the placement. So we'll make a granary here. And this granary will refuse everything and it will accept only meat. And that will be fine. And then we will go here and we will just make ranches, like three of those. Maybe three of those will be just fine, I don't know yet, but uh, well, we'll see. 
Yeah, that's the thing. We could actually, we can end up with um, losing some of our citizens because no, well, they are kind of cash right now with the pumpkins, so maybe we'll actually survive. I don't know. Well, we'll see. Yeah, but that's the idea that uh, uh, ranchers they are actually uh, doubling the amount of food that you are getting from wheat, and they can work the whole year. So that's very nice because then you can have only half of the farms needed. Uh, uh, to produce the amount and the same amount of uh, food that with pumpkins and so or potato potatoes uh, grow exactly the same as pumpkins uh, not in this uh, i think not in the same months but uh, the mechanic is uh, the mechanism is uh, pretty much the same so that's why for uh, a larger quantity of uh, pro cool. uh, for the a larger quantity of uh, uh, production it's better to have something that's actually working for the whole year because you are not getting a artificial unemployment and well we did uh, uh, we did discover what is happening when you have uh, 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 too high level of unemployment well basically people will just go and rise a couple of your buildings and that's actually kind, kind of problematic so yeah we don't want to do that again okay so we are producing i think we produce some meat and we don't have wheat so and uh, we are only in the half of the season so mm, yeah that may be a problem that may be a problem but we already have here meat we don't have meat here and uh, we have meat here so that's cool okay so we are pretty much okay with the meat for now maybe most likely so that's cool and we should have like a huge amount of wheat uh, in this on the end of the season so that's okay okay so um okay yeah go on and we have two percent unemployment so we still have to actually wait for more workers uh, because right now well we don't have enough workers to actually go and advance with anything so we just have to wait for a while yeah i don't really like this waiting game no but well we have to okay i will just speed up the game a little bit more because come on yeah we are not producing anything because we have no wait Come on. Yay, wheat. Okay, wait. And produce more than pumpkin than pumpkins, I think. Maybe, I don't know. I think so. And now it will be doubled. So that's very well. That's very well. And okay. So yes. And it's on a more concentrate, so supposedly and uh, the food will be uh, delivered to the shops on a more concentrate, so that should also help a little bit with the distribution of food, because those guys from the shops they can actually br they can actually grab a lot of food at once, and that's that's quite annoying because instead of supplying the whole city, they are supplying only one uh, one street, and the rest of the city is just basically starving. And while well, the one street is actually doing something, uh, I'm just going to prepare our workforce. What? No. I don't. I don't get what happened. It's okay. Okay, we are getting some. Uh, we will get some new workers, as I can see. Yeah. Okay. I'm not interested with uh, sending you any kind of silk or whatever, because well, I don't know you. Well, well, what can I do? I don't know what is the effect, the long-term effect of actually not fulfilling those missions. I, I, I don't really know. I don't really know. Maybe it's critical to the mission, but I don't know. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Okay, so now we, ha we should have a more uh, unemployed, unemployed people. We have unemployed people. That's very cool. And we have a great, nice amount of uh, wheat. I think the wheat idea was actually quite nice. Okay, so now the next step would be to go with uh, with alcohol, and to do and to go with alcohol, we need barley. So we have to create some barley farms. One, two, three, four. 
Okay. Here we go. And uh, where I could actually put our alcohol production. I think, I think. That here might be a good a good spot for our alcohol production. Uh, okay, so I will do something. Um, how I would like to do that? I like here, and that's very nice. And then I will just put here a uh, granary. Yes, and this thing will refuse everything and will accept only barley. Okay, that's cool. Now, uh, the next step here is to have a warehouse. And the warehouse will refuse everything but beer. And what kind of happen? And we have nine workers needed because everything is producing. Okay, that's cool, that's cool, that's very cool. And we still have to have here a maintenance guy maintenance guy that's a requirement anyway okay and uh, the first thing will be an abbey and we'll go with one abbey and we should be okay we should be okay come on and the very next step that we have to do is actually make a tax collector's office because we are not earning any money and that might be actually quite, quite important. Well, actually, we could do that right now. We could do that right now because that makes sense to do. Well, what can I do? Okay, and now where is the where is the town hall? Town hall here. And can we? Yeah, well, they are disappointed. As am I. Yeah, okay. This should be okay. Okay, and we will need the maintenance guy, um, somewhere around here, and we will still need the uh, tax officers to be here. And we don't really have the workforce, but we should be getting more. How many we need? Oh, 16. A lot. A lot. But they just have to get the beer and actually distribute it so we can advance and then we will have more workforce. Come on guys, come on guys. We are going good with the wheat and meat and so. Good. Do something. Oh, that. Yeah, there's some point. And okay, so we have more barley. We have better production. Okay, I see that the beer will be distributed somewhere here. Yes, here. I see it. So we should have more employees in a moment. And they will need a theater only. And that's a very, 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 very quick and dirty way to actually get more workers. Okay. How we are doing with the workers? How we are doing with the workers? We are doing better. Not swell, but better. Huh. I was hoping for, for a better increase. Okay, I see that we are getting here also them. Okay. So that should also help and now we are now we are starting to go now okay so we can go and make an additional abbey that will produce uh, more beer that's very well ok 
Okay, and they will. Okay, okay. Okay, so uh, the this is the first episode of uh, this uh, mission. So, and we are already on a level six housing. So that's very, very well. So uh, I will put a cut here, and we'll see each other next time. Bye bye.